Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. Today I am going old school and I'm doing an unboxing video. You guys know that I started out my channel doing a lot of unboxings, but today I'm gonna to be unboxing a Daily Look box. If you've never heard of Daily Look, they are a subscription clothing box curated to your style. So you go online and you fill out a whole questionnaire about what you like and what you don't like and just so they can get an idea of what your style is and this is the box right here I love how it looks it looks so like fancy um, I've done a lot of unboxings in my days and I feel like when I opened up this one like it comes to your door looking just like a regular box but then when you open it up and you see this pretty blue box with the ribbon I don't know there's something about it that I was like Oh my gosh, I feel so fancy opening this box. So I'm going to show you guys what I got in my box and I'm going to show you what it looks like on and how I styled the pieces. Um, I feel like you get a little bit of a better idea of what the pieces are instead of me just like holding them up and showing you. So if we get to the end of this video and you decide that daily look is something that you would like to try out, in the description box below there will be a link that you guys can follow to order your own daily look box and I really recommend this box. I actually really like liked the pieces in it. Sometimes they're really hit or miss, but I feel like they did a good job of kind of figuring out what my style was. And also they send you a whole bunch of pieces instead of just like five. And I feel like the more pieces that I get, the more that I'm likely to like the stuff in the box rather than being limited to only five pieces or so. And I am wearing one of the pieces right now. This is actually a dress that was my husband's favorite. I tried them on for him earlier to kind of get his idea on what he thought of them and this was his absolute favorite so I will probably be keeping this dress because of course his opinion is pretty valuable to me but I would love to hear what you guys think about the pieces once I try them on I feel like that's the best way to get an idea of how to or how the pieces look instead of me just holding them up out of the box I feel like if I show you what they look like and how I would style them you can get a lot better idea of what the pieces look like but if you guys will leave below what you think about each piece I would love to know your opinions so yeah let's go ahead and try on the clothes so this is what the dress looks like without the jacket and then um, I'm gonna show you what it looks like with the jacket but I just added the jacket because it makes it look a little bit more fall-ish and this is just a field jacket that you can just kind of lightly throw on um, but I just like how it's asymmetrical right here and then I just I love the navy color of it because I feel like I can pair any kind of brown with it and so I have it paired with these shoes and I've got a nasty little bruise right here um, but I just really liked how it looked and um, I like bringing the brown into this. This is like a navy color, so it's not quite black. Those are the shoes that I would wear, and then um, just this nice jacket, but I really like how it all looks together, and I feel like it's just a very flattering look. Okay, so here is a little black dress, and I have actually never owned something that is this length. I'll, length. I'll turn the, move the camera down so you guys can see in just a minute, and I actually didn't show this one to my husband, so he might actually like this. He loves these bodycon style dresses. I mean, you can see, look at my butt here, but let me move this down so you guys can see a little bit better. So this is the length of it. It's kind of like a midi length, and usually I'm like either short or long, um, but I feel like he would probably really like this one. These are just some wedges that I have it paired with. Um, I feel like this is a good like transition into fall kind of dress because of the length of it. I could still add the field jacket with it if I wanted to. Um, I feel like this is probably a little bit dressier, so I would probably put on like a different kind of jacket with it but still I feel like there's so many opportunities to use this dress for and also it's kind of ruched on the side and I'm thinking it would be a really cute like maternity dress because it's got that extra room in here if you need it but I actually really like this dress I wasn't sure if I would like it or if I had something similar to it but I feel like it just makes you look really tall and kind of elongates you you guys let me know what you think but I feel like this is just a really cute dress um, kind of like a staple to have in your closet 
Okay, so right now I have on a romper and I love rompers, but I have to be honest, this is probably not the best color for me because it is like exactly the color of my skin tone. And so it almost makes me look naked with a few stripes on my body, which is really awkward. Um, normally I love this color, but I feel like the color is just too close to my skin tone and it's not very flattering. So if you were a little bit tanner than I am, or this might look good when I am tan, but I like the fit of it and everything. I just think that the color is not very flattering on me, but let me show you guys what it looks like, um, the whole view, and then you can let me know what you think. Um, I feel like it kind of washes me out a little bit. It is really, really cute though. So I just have it paired with the same wedges that I wore for the black dress. And it is cute. I don't hate it or anything. I just feel like the color is probably not great for me, but you guys let me know what you think about this. Okay, so I've got on this white tank, and I feel like that this is really cute because it gives it a little bit extra flair rather than your just average white tank. And I love wearing white things, but a lot of times they're extremely see-through. This one is just a tiny bit see-through, so I may wear just like a nude color bra with it. Um, but I think that I can get away without having to put like an undershirt on under it, which is nice. And then I just like how different it looks on the sleeves here. I just feel like it's really pretty. And then I love love this jacket. There's something so different about this jacket. I've never seen or would think to pick up a jacket like this, but it's a very, very light. Um, I'm not even sure what kind of material this is. It feels like a rain jacket, but it is perfect for our weather here in Texas because it never gets cold um, rarely. And so this is just a jacket that I could throw on all fall all fall and I just I really like it it's been raining for the past four days here so I could actually wear this right now and it's got like a little hood on it here and I'm gonna um, move the camera down so you guys can see the whole outfit but let me know what you think about this jacket I feel like it's really practical and I would get a lot of use out of it okay so here is the whole outfit um, I just have it paired with these wedges that I had on at the beginning and then um, these jeans are also from the box this whole outfit is from the box I really like these jeans. I feel like it's super casual. I could also take these wedges off if I'm not doing anything fancy and put on some sneakers and wear it around to chase my kids. And um, then I can take this off if I want to. I could do a little front tuck with this. I feel like these jeans are a little bit higher than I, I like normally. Um, but I, that's just kind of a personal preference. But I really like the whole outfit. I think it's really cute and it's definitely something that I would wear. So I have on this really cute shirt with the jeans that I was just wearing and I love this shirt. There's just something so feminine about it um, and normally I don't go for off the shoulder things because I'm extremely self-conscious of how broad my shoulders are and I feel like sometimes it just kind of brings more attention to that and that's just kind of my own insecurity but I feel like this shirt is really really cute. So this is what it looks like and I love how it's kind of like a peplum down here at the bottom. Um, it's just so cute and the back of it kind of angles a little bit so that it's not short all the way around which I'm very thankful for because that is not always the most flattering on me. I like how it dips down a little bit and then I just have it paired with these wedges and I just really like the whole outfit. Okay, so next up is this pink top, and I actually didn't think that I would like this just kind of based on pulling it out, but once I put it on, I thought, oh, this is actually really, really cute. I love peplum tops when they're long enough for me because I have like a pretty long torso. So when they actually fit me right, I think that they're really cute, especially, you know, like when they angle them like this. I just have them paired with the same jeans. Um, these jeans, the color of them goes really well with a lot of these tops. And then the same, here, let me do a... So you guys let me know what you think about this top. It is just a tiny bit see-through, so I would have to wear just like a um, cami underneath it, but it's no big deal because the straps right here don't show, so it wouldn't be a big deal anyways. But okay, I apologize if the lighting is getting kind of weird. 
the sun just came out and it's been raining outside so now my lighting is getting crazy but I have on the white tank top that I tried on earlier and then I just put this little plaid shirt on over it I love plaid shirts I feel like they're gonna be a staple for the fall so this one is really cute I love how it's white because I love white so much it's kind of like a creamy white with some black accent to it and then I just have it paired with some shorts that they also sent me and these are by Hudson so let me move the camera down so these these shorts are by the brand Hudson and I do feel like they fit me pretty well I like the length of them um, sometimes rolled shorts can look a little bit funny on me but I think that they look really cute actually with this whole kind of outfit um, and then you could just wear some sneakers with it I don't have any shoes on right now because my sneakers are in the other room and my kids are out there and once I go out I'm, I'm done with so I can't go out there and grab them um, but I would just wear some Converse with this some lace-up sneakers or something this is like the perfect mom outfit um, you could also wear this like buttoned up if you wanted to you could also kind of tie it to the side um, I like to wear mine open um, with like something underneath it just to kind of give it a little bit of um, texture but you could also tie it like this if you wanted to leave it open um, it's just really cute and simple and like a perfect little mom outfit all right so that is it for my daily look unboxing and try on I hope you guys enjoyed this video if you are interested in ordering your own daily look box definitely check out the description box below there will be a link that will take you to their website where you can order your own daily look box and then decide what items that you want to keep and which ones you want to send back you obviously don't have to keep them all you don't have to keep any of them you just kind of pick and choose and then send your box back or send your stuff back in the prepaid bag that they give you and it is that easy if you guys are interested check out the link below don't forget to give this video a thumbs up if you enjoyed it and subscribe to my channel I would love to have you here and hit that bell notification next to the subscribe button that way you're notified whenever I upload videos and I will see you guys all in my next video bye